Hello, lovely people. So today uh, the subject is uh, love communication. And um, so we will talk uh, mainly about uh, the five uh, love languages. There is a book uh, uh, and many, many translations. You can find it. Uh, uh, and um, it says uh, about the, the five love languages. The book, uh, it says uh, no tantra in it. <laughs> it's, uh, but uh, I feel that it's, um, it's a lot of uh, about improvement uh, our communication. So uh, it's uh, really helpful for uh, tantra. So I'm using it. Yeah. So um, um, and I recommend to have a look. Uh, so what are the five love languages? Uh, five love languages are the different ways how we express love to each other. So um, um, we express it in uh, different ways. Uh, uh, some of uh, the people um, express it uh, in one way, a language, uh, another in another language, and also how they uh, would like to receive uh, it's in their preferable uh, language. And uh, the thing with uh, five love languages is that uh, um, if you do not understand uh, each other, then you can live with someone for uh, sometimes 15, 20 years and uh, asking yourself why is it not working uh, uh, and uh, why the other person doesn't understand me so much. Uh, and uh, you won't keep wondering uh, and uh, uh, you don't know why. Uh, when the Chinese person is speaking to a uh, Portuguese uh, person, uh, they quickly realize that uh, they do not understand each other, so they try to find another ways of communication. Yes? With the uh, love languages, it's a problem that uh, sometimes people uh, do not recognize that and they keep uh, talking to each other in the uh, wrong la language. What, uh, uh, no, no one uh, from them is understanding. So, um, yes, I would uh, tell you what are those five different uh, love languages. So, um, it's a physical touch, it's an act of service, words of appreciation, quality of time, and uh, sharing gifts. So uh, now I will explain uh, you how um, these um, languages uh, are characterized. Uh, so physical touch, the person who uh, have uh, that language uh, as a preference, it's um, uh, cuddly, uh, 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 she or he like the strokes, she like uh, intimacy, the touch, uh, um, it's uh, uh, a very hugging person. And uh, uh, if the person doesn't uh, receive uh, enough of uh, this uh, touch from uh, her partner, then uh, it hurts. It's uh, um, getting more and more frustration. Basically, at the beginning of our relationship, uh, according to this book and many other uh, theories, um, yes, we ha are starting with the full tank. Uh, we are in the honeymoon. Uh, so uh, full tank, full filled with love. And with the time, uh, after maybe when the honeymoon is over, uh, uh, the, if we do not uh, fulfill this tank with uh, uh, giving each other uh, the preferable uh, expression of love, what is good for us, what we uh, feel the best in it, then uh, the tank is getting empty and empty. So basically, yes, um, I, uh, I heard uh, at my uh, counseling sessions uh, um, uh, very often uh, complain, uh, yeah, uh, so what that he uh, uh, bought me all these uh, things, uh, material things, uh, uh, or, or uh, he did everything in the house, he was always uh, helping me with and fixing everything in the house. Uh, I, I, w what I just wanted, I wanted that he would give me five minute hug every day. And I asked him many times and he didn't. And that's why I, I, I could not stand with him anymore. 
I heard that a few times. So, so, so the person who have a, a physical touch uh, will have that complaint. Uh, 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 it's not only that uh, she or he expressing in that way the love, but also uh, uh, he or she would like to receive in that way the love. So, um, um, yes. Then uh, the, uh, another language uh, is uh, quality of time. The person who uh, have a preference for that language, uh, he or she will uh, choose uh, for um, yes, good uh, to to have good time together. Like uh, the person, uh, th that person uh, take care uh, that the uh, holidays is looking forward for holidays and uh, take care uh, and it's planning very good that oh uh, the. Uh, time on holidays, it would be very good quality, that resting and so uh, That person, for her or him, is important that uh, they go out. They uh, go to the concert, maybe to the party, maybe uh, they do something together. They have uh, basically the quality of time. Uh, they, they, they go maybe somewhere with the kids to have a fun, you know. Like, so, so for that person, it, this is very important. But uh, uh, yes, uh, uh, if, for example, uh, it will happen that uh, somehow you would tell that person, oh, we have to cancel, I, I cannot go uh, with you uh, for holidays, then she or he will put the cross on you. It's, uh, uh, it hurts uh, her, him, mostly, this, the, the, this kind of things, if she or he will not receive enough uh, of uh, quality of time. So, um, another um, language is act of service. Act of service uh, uh, is about uh, doing things for each other. So uh, making dishes, uh, preparing bed, uh, uh, preparing food, uh, um, um, taking care for uh, fi uh, financial security, for the house, uh, uh, and uh, yes, basically doing things for, for each other. And uh, yes, um, usually the, the you can recognize uh, very often uh, in uh, also uh, in communities uh, uh, that that person who um, have preference for act of service uh, he or she he would do all the time something for the others all the time but when he or she noticed that it's only he is doing things and uh, someone uh, doesn't do nothing to that person yes her tank his tank will get empty and then when it's empty, the frustration is more and more, and uh, uh, yes, uh, and yes, you can give uh, to that person, uh, uh, you know, uh, melting hacks uh, and uh, uh, all the quality of time uh, or whatever, but if uh, that's her preferable uh, language, then uh, yes, uh, uh, it's very important that you also do things for that person. So. Um, then another uh, language uh, is uh, the words of appreciation. And words of appreciation, you can recognize very often uh, uh, people with uh, that preference because they always outspoken about uh, uh, the, the compliments what they like to share. They always tell you, "Oh, such a nice dress you have. Oh, uh, your makeup looks so beautiful. You know, like, oh, uh, you dance so beautiful. You know, like." Uh, 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 they always say thank you, but if you forget too often to say thank you to them, they will put cross on you. Yes, so so uh, 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 for them it's also important that someone also is telling them. You know, like uh, so it's in the same uh, way uh, how uh, the complaint was about the uh, oh if you would give me five a minute hug, you know, like. Uh, I always hear the same complaint about this language, like, oh, if you would tell me sometimes that, oh, uh, I, I, I look good, or I, 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 he would appreciate that uh, uh, this what I cooked uh, is nice, tasteful, uh, uh, he would tell me about it, uh, I, I would uh, make more dinners and things like this to him, but if he doesn't, you know, like, it's like, uh, it's hurting that person. So, yes. Um, uh, the uh, sh next language is uh, sharing gifts. Uh, so sharing gifts, it's uh, the person uh, like uh, uh, who have the preference uh, 
uh, they never forget about someone's birthday and uh, they plan ahead uh, two three months they do the investigation the research what the person would like to have and then also like the, the, these people are, are very often they craft you know things they make uh, uh, things you know like uh, uh, with the yes that they really uh, um, want to give to, to, uh, to that person and yes uh, from the other side uh, if you will forget about their birthday and <laughs> you're not gonna or you got the uh, gift for them just five minutes uh, on the way uh, home uh, in the supermarket uh, uh, they will recognize it quickly and they will put cross on them so yeah so yes uh, um, so yes uh, those are the five uh, uh, love languages and uh, yes uh, as uh, in normal uh, languages uh, you can learn them you know? and it's very important to recognize it's not like sharing love it's not giving someone what you think the person wants but is giving someone this what she really wants yes so do you see the difference not good uh, yes not what you think she wants but yeah what she really wants yeah, yeah. yes so 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 this, this is love so you know like sometimes you know uh, for example uh, uh, in, from my life a bit you know like if my partner um, for her uh, uh, the cleaning standards are much higher than mine mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, and she is uh, um, feeling that uh, the floor should be wiped uh, uh, every day then you know maybe for me it um, could be once a week enough but uh, because I love her then I do it for her I do it uh, out of love to her you know and uh, uh, I don't have to discuss about it it's for her you know it's not for me it's for her so so basically that's how I learn uh, to speak in her language that's how I uh, do things what she wants not what I think she wants yes so that's that's very important so yes um, um, yeah and uh, uh, learning those languages and uh, knowing uh, recognizing uh, what is your preferable language and what is your partner's preferable language that's a, a very important thing in order to for us to communicate in the best way yes so um, yes uh, I recommend before uh, or, or when you start the re new relationship uh, also you can do it with your friends you know then also it helps you know you can do it with the kids you know like it also helps to recognize what is the preferable language and you can recognize it to uh, like uh, yes um, by knowing yourself uh, but also by hearing what the person mainly complain uh, about, you know, if uh, she complain about, oh, you never hug me, then means physical touch. If she complains, oh, you never say uh, something nice to me, then it means, you know, you have to hear what the person is speaking about, you know. So, um, yes. Uh, so uh, we're gonna exercise uh, now uh, all uh, those to. Um, feel them more and to uh, feel also 